Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today from Williams Sandwich Recipes of 1974, we're going to be making the healthy sandwich. Uh, this was sent in by Pam Hulsey of Eugene, Oregon to Williams back in the day. And um, it's healthy-ish. Start off with canned tuna. Add to that mayonnaise. Then we put that onto a whole wheat English muffin. That's right, whole wheat. And so far you're probably thinking, that's not that unhealthy, right? A thick slice of mozzarella cheese and then under the broiler to melt. Okay, so now we take our, what essentially is a tuna melt, add sesame seeds, two slices of avocado, and our top. Okay, let's give this healthy sandwich a go. It's not bad. It's a lot of cheese. I don't know why they called for a thick slice of cheese, but it's not bad. It's basically a tuna melt. Avocado is nice. Sesame seeds are just kind of there. I am gonna plus this up. And today, I'm going to choose violence. That's right, violence hot sauce from Solo and Family Farms. It's got ghost pepper, Trinidad scorpion pepper, vinegar, a spice blend, and agave. Okay, let's give this plussed up healthy sandwich a go. You're getting a little heat and a little acidity. It's playing off the very rich mozzarella cheese and mayonnaise. Okay, so the original healthy sandwich, um, and by healthy I mean, of course, it's like having a Diet Coke and pizza, um, <laughs> was tasty. It was not bad. It was a tuna melt. Probably would have toasted the top bun too, but it didn't say to do that. Um, and I definitely would have gone with less cheese. Still, it's pretty tasty. I'm going to give it a 7. Um, avocado was nice. With the Violence Hot Sauce, it's got the, the heat and the vinegar cutting through the richness of the mayonnaise and the cheese. I'm going to go ahead and bump that up to an 8. It is tasty, I am gonna finish it. Would I make it again? Probably not exactly like this, but I uh, might eat it again for sure. <laughs> All right, see you tomorrow. <laughs>